Today, thousands of people are registering to vote. It's part of National Voter Registration Day. Cronkite News reporter Isabella Holsizer attended several events and joins us live. Many of these nonpartisan events were held at high schools across the valley in order to get those who will be over 18 at the next election ready to vote. Phoenix hosted a voter registration party. Students who are or will turn 18 by the November election were invited. So it makes our voices be heard and it's a uh, change in the community. Students listened to a speech by Senator Kate Brophy McGee. Then they filled out their registration paperwork. Over 700 students were invited to the event and around 500 registered to vote. But according to Blanca Cayaso of the Arizona Center for Empowerment, the work does not end today. My registering to vote is the first step and the next step is actually voting. So I'm very excited for um, the 2020 elections and continuing to register thousands on thousands more students to vote. According to 2018 census data, less than 50 percent of 18 to 24 year old Arizonans are registered to vote. And in the 2016 presidential election, less than half of the 18 to 24 year olds in the state voted. Last year, more than 800,000 people registered to vote on this day. In the Media Center, Isabella Holsizer, Cronkite News.